New Zealand's nautical charts are published by LINZ for shipping and small craft operators. New Zealand charts provide considerable detail and are always fully up to date when purchased. They give you the water depth at low tide, the coast and its features as seen from the sea, latitude and longitude, the compass rows, navigation buoys, beacons, lighthouses, direction and rate of tides and location of hazards including tidal overflows and eddies. These charts use standard symbols. There are also charts for some areas such as the Leisure Craft series and similar information can be found in cruising guides. Even for skippers very experienced in their location it's wise to carry a chart on board in case they need to change their plans or to take shelter in an unfamiliar area. When sailing in tidal waters it's important to know the time and heights of high and low tides to avoid the risk of running aground. Check the tide times and heights before you go. Nowadays many pleasure boats have depth sounders or fish finders on board to help them avoid running aground. They're inexpensive and many have warning signals to advise when the water is becoming shallow. If you intend to make long coastal voyages you should know how to navigate from point to point safely. So make sure you are competent at navigation. A course such as coastal navigation run by Coast Guard is ideal. You'll then know how to use the appropriate navigation instruments such as the compass, parallel ruler and dividers to get the most out of the information on your chart. You'll get more pleasure out of planning your voyages and you'll feel more secure if something does go wrong with your GPS. Modern electronic aids such as GPS can be of great help particularly if it has a built-in map. It's not a good idea to rely solely on a GPS. Always carry a chart. In summary, by planning your voyage carefully before you set off, you should be able to navigate safely taking the tides and weather forecasts into consideration. If you share this information with your crew members, they'll find it interesting, reassuring and they should be able to help you navigate along the way. But check the weather before you go and use the five-day forecast to help with your planning.